Hi everyone, we have Dr. Sashi Morgan with us. He has been associated with us for last many years, since his MBBS days. He passed his FMG exam in his very first attempt by scoring 238 marks. After that, he joined internship and just after completion of internship in his very first attempt, he has secured marvelous rank in NEET PG. All India rank 1401. So, uh, so Dr. Sashi Morgan, Hatish, congratulations to you. How are you feeling now? Yes, sir, thank you, sir. Like I'm feeling very much overwhelmed, sir. Like very joyful, sir. Okay, that's great. So we can start with the basic introduction of yours, so that people can know about you. Hello, friends. This is Dr. Sasi Murugan. I'm from Salamputta, a small village from Tamil Nadu. I did from my MBBS from Asian Medical Institute, Kyrgyzstan. Uh, after I done with my MBBS, I did my internship from Dindayal Upadhyay Hospital, New Delhi. And uh, after completing my internship, within a span of two months, I given this uh, NEED PG and secured a rank of 1401. So during internship, it is very difficult to study, right? Because you have to work in hospital and DDU is one of the busiest hospital there. So you were to study, uh, you were able to study that time also? So like uh, initially it was a bit difficult for me to cope up with both internship mm -hmm. and studying for NEET PG. But I have a mindset like uh, I should come out of it and I should do some uh, specialization so I could get some recognition, sir. I know like uh, did you, like there is a huge um, passion flow was there but there are few uh, good uh, seniors were there like good DNBs were there who used to teach me also oh, yes. even this meantime and once I finish uh, my duty hours like even if it is 9 p.m. if it is a labor room duty of 24 mm -hmm. like 12 hours like I used to go library after it and I used to study at least four to six hours per day sir like even in any case sir. okay so basically there was the consistency right yes sir okay that's great so okay now you tell me how how doc tutorials was supportive to you Yes, sir, like that, like uh, I cannot tell in one word, sir, but it's a, a kind of emotions I, I need to tell because, like, it's the faculty you, Dr. Kalil, sir, Dr. Rajiv Dhawan, sir, uh, Dr. Dr. Rahul Rajiv, sir, and Dr. Sandeep, sir, like, you made it to feel uh, like a family person and you made to feel the hardest content in an easier manner, sir. Like, initially, I watched uh, videos and watched your classes uh, during my third year. And after, once I finish the whole video, I just go with your main notes only. Mm -hmm. So, like, once I done with the main notes, I have considered, like, asked many doubts to you. Mm -hmm. And after uh, doing this, I just did the QBank and given the GT, which was the best part of it, sir. Okay, that's great. Since you are, uh, you are also an FMG, okay. So, now you tell me how FMG exam was different from NEET PG. Sir, like the main uh, main change point is that the negative marking sir because in FMG like uh, once you prepare well like you will able to have this conference yeah like you will able to do it and it will be a cake for five you mm -hmm. um, uh, but whereas need PG in the sense it's a do or die situations because uh, like one mark can can decrease your rank by many thousands of ranks so uh, so it, it was very difficult for me to cope up those stress and uh, doing these questions under pressure, pressure was the most precious thing which I could tell you sir okay so you started uh, you started preparing for exams since your medical college or after or after the graduation sir uh, sir I said told like uh, I met you like uh, around four or five years before like yeah. I started my preparation in my third year of my MBBS mm -hmm. and uh, uh, I was uh, initially started with the main videos and um, like letter by bit by bit I completed and did the rapid revision sir and I completed um, before my FMG exam most of the things and during my internship I was just revising the notes which have been done for the FMG exams uh, with the doctor tutorials and I was give, solving questions and giving GTs in the most of the time sir. Okay that's great. So especially for your juniors or your friends who are going to appear for the next PG exam right. So what should be the best suggestion from your side? Sir like uh, my best suggestion is that don't go for any shortcuts. Uh, mm. The long videos are the main videos it will take some time uh, but do learn from this because uh, when you do internship this will help you out on the internship also will help you in this part because uh, most of the questions in the need PG uh, even in my session it was being asked in more clinical manner mm. and it should be answered if you see the patient or if you see the main videos mm. because rapid revision videos it won't give you the enough of life to the questions so do watch the main videos and uh, do a, a regular intervals of questions okay fine so one important question see so many fmg aspirants are there and they would like to get settled just after fmg they feel okay fine now this is enough 
So do you think this is uh, this is the right thing or they should be dreaming for something more? Yes, like this I should answer for sure mm -hmm. as an FMG because like many of them they think like FM passing in FMG is like crossing the river once it's done and it is done. No, it's not like that sir because like uh, once you just pass FMG you are just an MBBS graduate and uh, you will be always uh, under confident uh, with your works because uh, you will be always needing suggestion from your seniors and mostly you will be under confident and if you can do FMG exam you can do the NEET PG exam easily and uh, once you done with the NEET PG exam you will be specialized in a uh, in a specialization and it will give you more uh, enthusiasm to work on the medical field and it will help you to grow more sir. like this is my suggestion sir. okay that's great and so many of you are juniors of your college they must be very proud today right they must be celebrating I have seen so many posts of yours Right now, so what is the best suggestion for your juniors of your own college? Ask yes, me. Uh, yes, like uh, means what I feel is that the best decision what they have made is that to join the, uh, my college because they have we have a good uh, president, good vice uh, rector, Dr. Prashant Prashant sir, and uh, like our coordinators, Gigi ma'am and uh, Nishant sir, Nalan sir. So like they they are in a good team and they had in a good curriculum sir and if you study in in the university itself and start yearly uh, with uh, with the classes and the videos this will help you to achieve your dream in a proper time and as i tell you uh, start yearly do your notes multiple times and don't stop with fmg do uh, need pg as well this will be like uh, um, this will, these are the words from my bottom of my heart so do take care of it and do need pg for sure Okay, that's great. Okay, fine. So as per your rank, you can get uh, like any branch, whatever you want. So what is your dream branch? So like from childhood itself, mm -hmm. like I want to, uh, like I dreamed myself as a surgeon, sir. So nice. I want to become a surgeon, sir. Okay, that's good. So which part of India you would like to work in? So like mainly like I'm from South India, but uh, like I did my internship from Delhi where I'm able to see uh, the work-life balance and the people mentality and uh, uh, mainly the patient flow. So these are all very well versed in New Delhi. So I'm planning to take my uh, post-graduation in surgery in New Delhi, sir. Yeah, so much patient exposure is there indeed. So, okay, Dr. Sashi Murgan, yes, so that was great information. Okay, now you tell me what was the best part about Dr. Tutorial? Yes, the, there are, it's not the only one best part, there are many best parts about Dr. Tutorials. The, uh, the main is the faculties, mm -hmm. um, like which they have, like they are more friendly enough, like Dr. Rajamahindra and Sayu, mm -hmm. Dr. Khalil sir, they are more friendly and uh, they make these clinical subjects uh, like in a uh, like a piece of cake. Mm -hmm. This is the first thing, and second is the uh, faculty curated Q Bank, sir, like it mm -hmm. helps really a lot and third is the GTs uh, like GT whichever they make it simulate the main exam and even like uh, the final exam it's a kind of GT for you and it's a final GT also so it was the same it gives the same similar simulation as an EPG exam sir and final point I shouldn't miss the main the rapid revision and the final 20 uh, question series it really, yes, sir. it really helped me a lot and there was uh, like uh, there was no words to describe it because there are few questions which I thought like uh, the same it was from the series sir. okay that's nice okay so uh, so actually I remember uh, for the first time we had interview when you passed your FMG exam and this is the second time we are having interview I'm hoping I'm expecting that next time when you will be there for super specialization so we shall be interviewing again right so keep shining keep rising I wish you all the best and we shall always be in contact thank you so much thank, thank you sir. thank you so much and everyone thank you so much bye bye